in this quick short video i am going to show you how to create your own simple grid trading forex robot simple no trading skills needed here everything is just going to be done for free and simple so what is grid trading uh grid trading is like this i'm not saying we're going to create something like this but this is just an example sometimes uh, uh you have people who do not want to analyze their charts and basically you just want to go with whatever price does so what happens is you can place a uh, place pending orders like this for example if price is here then you place buy pending orders for going this way and you place sell pending orders going in this way so whatever price chooses to do uh your pending orders will be would be triggered if price goes up or your pending orders will be triggered if price goes down and then you can simply just manage your trades as you go along there is no analysis needed to do uh, that you just put in pending orders both directions so that's basically what grid uh, trading is all about so instead of doing all of this manually you can actually just do it automatically so that's what we are going to do with our simple forex robot that we are going to make today so we are going to go to fx dreamer uh, this is what uh, the previous robot that we did if you are new on this channel and you are new to fx streamer there is going to be an example robot here you can just uh no more click highlight it and right click and you delete so that we start together on a clean sheet like this okay so uh once you have done that uh let's uh continue so the first thing that we want to do is we want to go to our time filters uh it's up to you to decide how you want this uh, robot to uh, perform to operate but you probably want to start with once a day so uh this block tells the robot that once a day by the way we are on the tick uh, section so once a day we want the robot to do something uh we are going to tell the robot to first of all uh let's say delete pending orders yes so first of all once a day as the new day starts we want the robot to delete any previous pending orders that were not filled from the previous day or you can instead of once per day you can use once per hour uh, let's see the time filters there you see once an hour once per minute and stuff like that it's basically up to you uh, the time filters uh, you can use the time filters uh, that uh, suit you here but we are just going to uh, use once a day for this uh, example so it's going to be uh once a trading day the robot is going to do this so it's going to start by deleting pending orders uh any pending orders uh, let's double click and just see uh what's in there so any pending orders that are going to be on the chart when this uh, robot uh, uh recognizes it's a new day it's going to delete them either they are buys or sells depending on what uh, pending orders you had the previous day or the pending orders that you are using so uh, if you are only using maybe one type of uh, pending order then you want maybe to only delete the sales or the buys or whatever but here we are deleting all of them we are starting on a new page that's what we are telling the robot or you can filter by symbol you can tell it to delete a specific uh, specific pending orders on a uh, specific forex uh, trading pair it's basically up uh, to you so we are not going to just uh, do anything there we're just going to update so if you are new to fx streamer you already know that it's free for metatrader 4 uh, for metatrader 5 you just need to pay a little amount which you can easily recover if you sell your robot or if your robot is profitable uh the mt4 still uh limits you to around 10 blocks uh these are the blocks so we have got two blocks 
here. We have got two blocks so far, so we still have eight that we can uh, add to our robot and we still can do this for free. Okay, so after this, uh, once a day, we tell the robot to remove any any pending orders from the previous day or if you are using once per hour is going to delete any pending orders from the previous hour that's uh, that were not filled then after that we are going to tell the robot to what to put buy pending orders in grid and we're just going to leak everything like that and we're going to double click and go in there and we are going to say how many uh, orders to place uh, grid levels. So basically, we can just tick uh, these uh, uh, gray boxes so that we can uh, edit things uh, without coming back to FX Streamer. You can edit things uh, right in uh, MetaTrader 4. So let's just do that and that and uh, that. At least those are the ones that I usually uh, love to use. You can use uh, round numbers, but uh, for now, let's uh, just leave it as that. So, orders to place. This is the uh, amount of orders that uh, the robot is going to place for buys. So, if it's three, it's going to place one, two, three uh, uh, pending orders on your chart, the buy pending orders. And the 25 grid size is the 25 is the distance between those pending orders, which is going to be what? Which is going to be 25 pips. So it's going to place one pending by pending order, uh, 25 pips, one pe uh, by pending order, uh, and between them is 25 pips. That's what we are telling the robot to do here. Then obviously fixed uh, volume uh, here. You can tell the robot. Uh, uh, the lot sizing that you are using then obviously here you can also put in what your your stop loss for those pending orders and your take profit for those uh, pending orders uh, it's uh, really uh, very easy here it's very easy here. Uh, you can just see also if there is anything that you want to do here maybe you want the pending orders to expire so you can basically say what time you want them to expire for now let's just leave to no expiration and otherwise from here we update and then for our buy pending our sell pending orders we are going to drag this and we are going to link everything uh, just like uh, that and we are going to double click and we're going to go in there. You can simply see it's run about the same thing. Run about the same uh, deal. Uh, let's just do this. You already know how to do that. Uh, let's make it a uh, hundred uh, there. And that's basically it uh, for our robot. And we update. And we have used only four blocks. Only four blocks. Very simple. Uh, 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 grid trading robot that we've just made here the rules again of oh, once every day it's going to delete any uh, pending orders that were not filled from yesterday then it's going to place uh, three by pending orders uh, between them there's going to be a distance of 25 pips and it's also going to place three pending orders uh, sell pending orders and between them there's going to be uh, a distance of 25 uh, pips and we'll already have our TP and our stop loss uh, in there and then we simply have to what to come here and we change the name uh, of our robot what do we call it today is Wednesday I do not call it Wednesday robot because I think previously I did another Wednesday trading robot um, I don't know what you want to call it. Uh, let's just call it uh, uh, Grid Trader. That's it. And we click on Done there. And obviously, you click on MQ4 to get your, your, your source code. Then you can click EX4 to get your executable file that you can share with your friends, your cousins, your family, 
to use your amazing uh, robot. So that's it, guys, about uh, this. If you have anything else that you want me to show you, uh, out one, uh, at least give you a direction of what to do uh, in FX Streamer, write it in the comment section below. I'll definitely show you how to simplify, how to simply do it. At least if I do not show you the complex stuff, at least I'll give you the di direction that you need to take. If you are new on this channel, please consider subscribing. That's why that's how you are not going to miss any future videos. Go ahead and like this video. Otherwise, guys, if you need everything, uh, see the links in the description box below. Yes, about my broker, the link is in the description box below. With just five dollars, you can open a real live trading account, and basically, you can test uh, these robots. And if it's making money, then you can give that robot more money and basically that's it guys i will see you in the next uh, video bye